Bonjour à tous and welcome to Learn French with Vincent and this is a vocabulary video in which we'll discover together 15 gestures and expressions in French, okay? So I hope you're ready. It is the second part, so if you want to find the first part, well, it's possible. Just use the search engine of the channel. But now we are starting. So the screen will be divided in two. You will have the first part here with uh, my friend Laurent, and he will do the, the gesture for you, and you will have the expression that normally comes with this gesture, okay? And the first one is explique, so it's coming from the verb expliquer, to explain. So basically it's when you want, you're discussing with, th with someone and you want to have some, well, more information uh, regarding what he or she just said, and that's the gesture, if you look at Laurent, that's the gesture you will have to make to require more information to require the person you're talking with to explain, okay? Second gesture now. Moi, je dirais donc. Moi, je dirais donc. So, you're discussing with someone and you would like to say something. You would like to add something. You would like to express yourself. So, you can make this gesture. You can see that Laurent is doing that mostly with his arm. Let's have a look at him. And that's it. Okay. Next gesture. A propos. A propos could be straight translated by by the way. Okay. A propos. So look, everything is in the arm. That's it. A propos. All right, so translation, by the way. Pas question. Well, clearly you refuse something, you don't want something. Look, the end goes like that. And normally you tend to say no with your head. Let's have a look one more time. Non, pas question. The other one, ah, pardon. Let's have a look. All right, so you want to say something, you are discussing with someone, and you say, ah, pardon. So you want to probably add something that will be uh, not the opposite, but you're not going in the same direction as the person you are talking to, and you want to, you know, say, ah, pardon. Look, the finger like that. Je ne suis pas d'accord d'ailleurs. Okay, so in that case, you just want to say that you don't agree. Okay, so let's have a look at the gesture. You are not in the same line of thinking than the person. So look at the end like that and the finger. Okay. And then the next one, zero. Well, zero, it's quite clear. It's like in many languages, you're ordering the zero like that. And it's, well, you want to express or to say that uh, it is clearly quite bad. Okay, so zero, look at the head. Laurent is not really happy. So you just want to say that maybe it's a movie, maybe it's uh, something it just so read and it was really bad, zero. Okay, pas de doute, no doubt, all right? So no doubt, pas de doute, and look, everything is in the hand, of course, you can do like him with your head, look, one more time, pas de doute, no doubt about it, okay? The next one, vous voyez, translation, straight tra tra translation, sorry, <laughs> you see, okay? So you are discussing with uh, someone, maybe the person does agree with you, or then, you know, you just like, you see. One more time. Vous voyez, okay? Premièrement could be translated as first, okay? So you will like to, uh, well, introduce probably several things and then you will start with the first one. And the first one is premièrement. So of course, 
your hand and then it's the first one. Je ne crois pas, I don't think so. That's the straight translation. Je ne crois pas, okay? And look, <laughs> it's only in the head and you're looking at the sky or the ceiling if you want. And when you do like that, well, basically you just want to uh, give the information to the person you're talking to that I don't think so. Je ne crois pas. Okay, and that's it. The next one, attention un. Look. All right, so you want to warn the person. Attention, be careful. Okay, so it's a warning. Look, it is a warning. And of course, you don't look really happy when you give this warning. So it's not a good sign. It's not a good thing, but still... Gare à toi, okay, so it's usually the expression that usually we will use with kids, okay, so be careful because I could do something bad, look, yes, that's the way, all right, so it's a quite old-fashioned, you know, but then still it's possible to see it, so be careful, gare à toi. Tu veux un marron, okay? So if you want to threaten someone, like here, you want to threaten someone and tell him that, or she, that you could hit this person, so it's a threat. Look, tu veux un marron, you want me to hit you. Bof, clearly when you use this expression, or... This gesture, so it's not a gesture, it's an uh, expression from the face, if you look at it one more time. Okay, so technically, let's say that someone <laughs> proposed to go to see something or an activity or something, you don't really want to do that, you're not really interested. Okay, so you say both. And that's it, my God, it's really difficult, you know, to introduce all these gestures and these expressions, especially to explain them quite clearly. I hope it was clear enough for you. If you want more videos, then youtube.com slash is waiting for you and the website www.imagier.net. Have a great day. Bye-bye.